Hi all, this is Brendan and I am going to talk about goal setting for a DevRel team today. And this is based on a framework which I have used um, coming to five years now and uh, it's uh, been iterated on and so this is version four um, of the approach. All right, let's uh, do a quick overview before we do a live demonstration of this in action. So, um, objectives and key results, that's what OKR stands for, and OKRA with an A at the end, the A stands for action. So it's objectives, key results, and actions, and that's the framework. So this is designed to be done iteratively, and using the spreadsheet is intended to be used for planning, not necessarily for tracking. So um, I'll cover how to use this particular template with a spreadsheet to plan your objectives and key results but I won't necessarily be using this, uh, using this for tracking later on. So it's up to you and you can, you know, um, post planning input this into your uh, specialist OKR tracking software if you would like to. All right, so just a quick overview. You start off with objective, key result and type, right? Which is either lead or lag and we'll get to all that detail later on and then you map it out for all of your objectives and key results. Next up, you have start value, end value, and units. And this is another tranche, another iteration. So where you decide how much um, of this particular key result you're going to impact. And then you've got your actions. Um, and th those are divided into preparation as well as um, what you do to move the needle, metric, metric actions. And then in the next tranche or iteration, you'll do how do you measure this and you know any notes which are optional then we'll talk about um, who does the work and in what um, in what capacity so you've got um, a racing matrix uh, effectively and finally you put in some dates um, and so this is like sort of very minimal um, like when do you start and when do you end all right so that's the overview and let's begin so what I'm going to do is provide a link to this spreadsheet in the description below, and after afterwards you can uh, op after you've opened it and made a copy, you can go ahead and um, follow along. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to create a hypothetical DevRel team and create some metrics for it, um, and you can watch as I follow along. All right, let's begin. So I'm going to make a copy and remove the word template and call it 2024 for this year and Q4 since that's the next quarter and make a copy. All right, so now we've got a new copy of the spreadsheet. So that's the template and this is a new copy. Um, no difference yet, but this is the one we'll be editing. 